Apparently there is uh, words you won't use in recipes. Oh, yes. Right. No, we, we well, because um, when I write books, I'm dyslexic, so I have quite a relationship with the books and how I put them together and uh, numbers and um, words. And then there were certain words that didn't quite work in the culinary situation. So it's, I basically banned words. And then I made the whole editorial team agree and sign to never, ever. But now, some of them I understand, but there's a list of them. This is the list of the banned words. Now, moist, I know, <laughs> I know what you mean, but some things, some recipes yes. should be moist. They all have reason. I'm not sure you... I mean, do you ever need crevice? No, crevice. <laughs> well, yeah, because if you're stuffing, like, a shoulder of lamb and you want to really get it into the crevice, <laughs> you say crevice, but crevice and dinner doesn't really work, as does rimming. And rimming is... <laughs> rimming, rimming is really important in pastry work. Cause you're, yeah, because you have to give it a good rimming to, to <laughs> get the pastry, and then you bake it. We're in it. Blackpool again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah.